Them, P, them PPP loans ran out. We just started to hit the lick. Almost got caught lacking. The strap, but he didn't pull out quick enough. Yeah. Whatever this boy had in was not worth it. Sheesh. Don't kill me. I'm gonna do that in a little while. Appreciate it. Yeehaw. Wait. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. We standing on this here. Got to. Hey, man, I really ain't want to speak on this shit, but I know it's too many young black kings and young kings out there that's being misled and misguided wrong, learning half of the game and not the whole game. So y'all need to learn from this experience that I went to tonight because being a rapper is one of the most dangerous jobs in America. And there's a lot of young men out here that want to do this shit, but don't know everything that come with it. But I want to speak on this part right here, understand this. Everybody don't go. Everybody don't go and everybody ain't going. And I'm one of them people that's not going. So unfortunately tonight somebody lost their life for doing something stupid. And I don't know how it happened or what was going on, but I really would like all the young black men around here to learn before all the tabloids and the bullshit and the fake stories get out there. I want y'all to learn from this experience. And I'm still standing here 10 toes down, all my jewelry and everything that I worked hard for. I don't want you to go through these dumb ass situations for doing something stupid that somebody taught you or led you to do that you can go be. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Miguel Tucker, aka Big Finn Ball, aka your baby mama's mercy contact, aka your mother's number one entanglement. And before we get started, I just want to let you guys know that the Miguel Tucker TV channel was now accepted donations. So make sure you guys donate to the channel so we can keep pumping out that exclusive content for you guys. Anything helps. Also, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Man, this shit crazy, man. Um, so apparently Sauce Walker, uh Houston rapper Sauce Walker was involved in an attempted robbery. Um, which resulted in the assailant getting killed, laid out on the floor, as you guys saw on the video before, you know, my commentary started. Um, this is crazy, you know. Oh, this is so, so crazy. I mean, I, I, be, I, be, I be telling niggas, man, like, um, L.A. is at an all-time high. Like, it's an all-time high. Of, like, it's just a, a scrimmage fest right now. Everybody is starving out there. Everybody just wants to make a name for themselves. And it's a lot of dusty niggas who, you know, they, they think they're gangsters, but no, they just broke niggas with that bad attitudes. You understand what I'm saying? And um, that that's that's a real crazy situation, man. You hate to see another black man get laid out on the floor like that, but at the same time, who's raising these niggas? You know what I'm saying? Like, I think that young man should have had a, a, a thought, you know, a, just, just he should have had just a thought. Like, why would you walk up on somebody? Why would you walk up on somebody thinking you can take their chain and think you're just going to live and tell about it? You understand what I'm saying? I always tell motherfuckers, you take something to mind, you better be ready to get buried with it. You understand what I'm saying? Shit is crazy. And I know it was one of these little stupid ass gang members out there. You know, these niggas with no daddies, no fucking guidance. You know what I'm saying? And probably being his OG is probably like two years older than him. Probably sent them off on a dummy crash missing w crash mission and you know said sauce walk is here go take his chain you know we'll give you some we'll give you some rank in the set or some shit and now look at him he's he's a fucking corpse now you know it's crazy for all eyes to see was it worth it was it really worth it you laid out in your dirty ass nikes you know what i'm saying it's crazy all i gotta say man hey shout out to sauce walker man uh hopefully you get back home one piece, man, and shit, stay out of L.A., man, like, I mean, I, I understand you gotta get your money out there, but stay away from them thirsty, hungry-ass, dirty niggas, man, because, like, it, it's just, it's, it's not a good time, it's not a good time to be out in, in Babylon right now, you know what I'm saying, and, um, another thing I, I gotta throw in there, right, a lot of these California niggas, they really think they, they, they think, like, they just, the most gangster niggas on the planet, I need to explain something to you between a California nigga and a Texas nigga, See, down here in Texas, we don't have to hide our guns. We don't have to put these motherfuckers under under a car seat. We don't have to hide these bitches in the engine. We walk with them bitches on us, okay? And you can see, like, the you know, it's not really a high murder rate in Texas like it is in everywhere else, like in all these blue states. You know why? Because everybody is blicked up, you know? And when everybody is blicked up, motherfuckers are more respectful with their, with their speeches and how they move and how they act towards another motherfucker. You understand what I'm saying? So let this be a lesson to all you niggas that think y'all just overly tough because y'all, you know, you, you, you got jumped. You, you were forced to fight five niggas for five minutes. You know what I'm saying? You're not tough, okay? 
You're not a gangster. You just a broke nigga with a bad attitude. Okay? Y'all niggas need to do better out there. And I'm not even mad at the, the young niggas. These old niggas. These old niggas have failed y'all out there. Okay? These old niggas have failed y'all out there. So, I blame the OGs for this, for this little nigga laying on the ground right now because they should have taught him better. Okay? <sighs> but I digress, man. Uh, like I said, man, shout out to Sauce Walker, man. Shout out to, shout out to the whole Houston, Texas, man. Shout out to the whole TSF, man. Y'all already know how the fuck shit, how the fuck shit going. You already know. But, um... It's crazy, man. So, so crazy. It's unfortunate, too, man, because if this nigga would have succeeded, he probably would have needed a public defender. Now he needs a GoFundMe. And before all y'all little bitch niggas get in my comment section talking about, oh, Miguel, man, that's fucked up, bro. Why you talking about a dead kid, bro? Why you dissing the dead? Man, fuck that nigga, okay? Fuck that nigga and fuck the niggas who raised him, okay? People like y'all are y'all enabling these type of motherfuckers, okay? You're not helping the fucking situation. You're actually part of the problem, okay? But I digress, man. Uh, we're going to end it off right here, man. You guys make sure you guys are washing your ass correctly. Make sure you guys are brushing your teeth before you go to bed. Make sure you guys are loving your families. Make sure you're taking care of your families because that's all we got. Um, make sure you guys are staying in a good mental headspace. Uh, make sure you guys are vibrating high above all this madness because this shit ain't nothing but the devil. You, you clearly see. Um, this is We living in Babylon, man, especially L.A. L.A. is Babylon. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. Babylon. Babylon kings, man. Shout out to all my Caribbean brothers and sisters, even the racist ones. Um, Shout out to my big sister out in St. Kitts, man. I'm so proud of you, big sis. We all love you. Can't wait to see you soon, man. And, um, yeah. Oh, also, if you guys listen to rap, man, make sure you guys check out my shmoney freestyle. Also, make sure you guys check out um, new music from Hard Body Sco, a.k.a. Frisco F. You understand what I'm saying? He got a new record all called Stay Focused, man. Uh, make sure you guys stream that on all streaming platforms. I'm going to leave the link in the description box below. And also, make sure you guys check out new music from Black Efron. He just dropped a new record called Handle It. Make sure you guys go run those views up, man. Make, let them know Miguel sent you. You understand what I'm saying? Number good music, bro. That's all we provide is quality content, which is commentary, music, all type of shit. You feel what I'm saying? But yeah, man, uh, that, that's enough me running my clit liquor. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Almighty. Oh, yeah, before I leave, though, before I leave, um, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Um, get me in that algorithm. You know what I'm saying? I'm starting to do these reactions, like, full time now. Yeah, get me in that algorithm. So, you know, I'm trying to grow a little bit, get to that first 1K. And, um, yeah, hit that um, hit that notification bell so I can be the first. So you be the first one to get the notifications when I do drop another video, okay? So you can get straight to it, cut through the noise, all that, okay? Love y'all. Be great. Dreams come true when you stay focused. But I've been dying inside with all this pain on me, niggas, and change. On me. I know we ain't homies. If they go down right now, I know they won't ride for me. Uh -huh. Dreams come true when you stay focused. But I've been dying inside with all this pain on me. Niggas and changed on me. I know we ain't homies. If they go down right now, I know they won't ride for me. Uh -huh.